Hello, readers. Today's book is Girl vs. Squirrel. It's written by Haley Barrett, and it's illustrated by Renee Andriani. Girl vs. Squirrel. Pearl built three bird feeders. One looked like a house, one looked like a tube. One looked like a teacup perched on top of a tall pole. It looked like a teacup because it was a teacup. Pearl was particularly proud of it. She filled the house bird feeder with suet. She filled the tube bird feeder with seeds. She filled the teacup with peanuts. Lots of birds love peanuts. Pearl took the lens cap off her binoculars and waited. Cardinals and flipper, flickers swooped in for suet. Finches and chickadees sailed in for seeds, but not a single bird could settle on the teacup because something else wanted those peanuts. Hey, protested Pearl. Bird feeders are for birds, but the squirrel didn't flinch. Instead, it flicked its tail and gobbled Pearl's peanuts, each and every one, before dashing to a hole in an old oak tree. Drat that squirrel, grumbled Pearl. It may be brave, but it's no match for me. Girl versus squirrel is on. With her hockey stick and some duct tape, Pearl extended the teacup's pole. There, she said, that's tall enough to stop any squirrel in its tracks. She watched, breathless with anticipated success, but was soon disappointed. Drat, drat that speedy squirrel, she groused. I'll make the pole taller. Now the teacup towered, but that didn't de deter the squirrel. It scurried up the mop, scrabbled up the hockey stick, and shinnied straight up the pole. Oh no, Pearl groaned. Brave, speedy, and determined too. The squirrel stared at Pearl and seized an especially plump peanut. But before it could take a nibble, the pole began to teeter and totter until thud. It toppled to the ground. The teacup popped off the pole, the handle snapped, up, snapped off the teacup, and the startled squirrel skedaddled to the tip-top twig of the old oak tree. Drat, 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 you squirrel, growled Pearl. You're a bird feeder crashing, teacup smashing, peanut poaching pest. Pearl poked through the grass and peanuts to find the teacup's handle and muttered, but you will never, ever, ever be a match for me. While Pearl glued her teacup, she pondered and plotted. Step by step, she pulled together a plan to put that squirrel to the test. Stay tuned for part two.